Welcome to MoreThanTheGames.com's Vancouver 2010 coverage. I am Samuel Green, and after Canadian hearts were broken when Jennifer Hoyle was pipped to the gold medal yesterday, Valentine's Day has seen Alexandra Bilodeau go down in history as Canada's first home Olympic champion. The 22-year-old finally ended the host's 34-year wait with a spectacular display under intense pressure to notch a score of 26.75 points and snatch victory from Vancouver-born Australian and defending champion Dale Begg-Smith by 0.17. An incredible double-twisting backflip sealed the win for the proud Canadian, while America's Byron Wilson secured the bronze medal. The men's luge reached its conclusion on a shortened track as a mark of respect following the tragic death of Nodar Kumaritashvili. Germany's double world champion Felix Loch celebrated an Olympic debut gold medal with a track record and became the youngest ever champion at 20 years old. His fellow countryman David Moller, who won last season's World Cup in Whistler, captured silver, and bronze went to legendary Italian Armin Zogler, who fell short of emulating the great George Hackle's three successive Olympic triumphs. Frenchman Vincent J tore up the form book to pick up a shot gold in the biathlon 10km sprint ahead of Norway's Emil Helgel Svensson and Croatia's Jakob Fak. Heavy snow had a damaging effect on the favourites, as five-time gold medal winner Ole Einar Bjorn could only finish 13th. And the French sealed another gold through Jason Lamy Chapuis in a thrilling finish to the Nordic combined when the current World Cup leader overtook American Johnny Spillane on the final corner. Italian Alessandro Pitan took bronze. Chinese favourites Shen Zhu and Zhao Hongbo set the standard with a flawless first dance in the figure skating pair's short programme. The three-time world champions posted a personal best score of 76.66 to Queen's Who Wants to Live Forever to seal their advantage going into Monday's free skate. The Czech Republic's world number one Martina Sablikova stormed to gold in the women's 300m speed skating as Germany's Stephanie Beckert and Canada's Christina Groves trailed behind to complete the podium. Jenny Potter bagged a hat-trick as double world ice hockey champions the USA smashed China 12-1 in Group B, while Finland's women cruised to a 5-1 victory over Russia. Here's all the news from Great Britain's skiers, sliders and skaters in Canada, brought to you in association with Lloyd's TSB, proud partner of the London 2012 Olympic and Paralympic Games and supporter of Team GB on their journey to Vancouver 2010. In the 10k biathlon sprint, Lee Steve Jackson finished 55th from 87 to equal his best ever result on his Olympic debut. Adam A.J. Rosen slipped a position in the luge late on to record 16th place, equaling his result from 2006. And Stacey Kemp and David King produced a respectable performance in the figure skating pair's short programme, posting a 16th place finish out of 20 with a score of 48.28. France go first in the medals table thanks to their two Nordic golds over at Whistler, while a gold and two silvers top Germany's total up to four. For the latest news, interviews and behind the scenes gossip from Sportsbeats reporters at Vancouver 2010, visit morethanthegames.com or follow us on Twitter at Sportsbeat. <laughs>